Okay, this one is over screen space global illumination, a new feature in Unreal Engine 4 dev rendering that got added like three days ago. So in this scene, we're gonna go ahead and turn off everything. I'm gonna show you what uh, global illumination is with ray tracing, and then I'll put four samples on there. And then the same scene, let me go to the side. So we've got color and light bleed from the wall over to the box, which we're supposed to have. Let me move it. And as we get closer, it gets darker and more, <laughs> more color bleed. And then the same thing for the other side. And these are diffused white boxes. And if you want some of the, um, the noise to go away, we could turn up the samples and, and they would go away. There we go. All right, so I'm gonna put that back and I'm gonna do the same thing with screen space ambient occlusion, or I'm sorry, screen space global illumination. So we're gonna turn global illumination off. We're gonna turn on screen space global illumination. This is quality zero. There's one, two, three, four, and the last one is five. Whoa. Okay, so on here it's screen space oriented, so if we leave track of the wall, obviously it goes off just like screen space reflections. But if it's here and I bring the box closer, closer, we're gonna get nearly the same effect. Um, and then the same thing with the red. But as soon as you leave it, it goes away, just like screen space. But the, the effect's fantastic. And if you multiply that with light propagation volumes, um, looks pretty good. And it's a, a great middle ground that's just been added. All right, guys, that's it for this week.